Hello YouTubers and welcome to Chris and Tim's Simple How-To Videos. I'm Tim. Alright, today I'm going to go over the uh, dreaded port 3659 UDP. You know, they make sure it's open. Alright, a lot of people are doing this through their uh, router, uh, even the firewall. I'm not positive that that's the answer because I've actually done it with a friend of mine, this particular friend right here. Um, and it hasn't worked so I was doing some uh, research and this is what I found out there's a couple different ways the first way and the most logical would be to right click on your game and repair uh, try that first just to see if it works out anything another thing I would recommend doing is going into start go to computer local disk C x86 uh, let me slow it down for you guys a little bit so you go into your local disk C, double click, find programs, and scroll down until you see your origin games. Then open that. Now the, the particular game you're having problems with, say Battlefield 4, open that. Go to installer. And then find Punkbuster. Then R-E-D-I-S-T. Now double click on that, as you'll see it'll pop up the Punk Buster. And it'll say install, reinstall Punk Buster. This is one of the things I recommend. Alright, after the repair. Okay, if you're still having the same problem, what I did was I went to uh, my command function. CMD. This might require a password. Then in here I went IP C O N F I G IP config hit enter. Okay, and then the same thing you do IP C O N F I G with a forward slash. And you do release. Okay, then you'll hit enter. And what this will do? This is going to release your uh, IP. Okay. You hit it once, and if you're connected to the internet, you're going to lose it for a second, but don't panic. Alright, now I've released my internet connection, and now I'll be disconnected from the internet. Um, probably here in a second, my TeamSpeak shut down. Alright, and then what you want to do after that is you do IP, C-O-N-F-I-G, forward slash, and then you want to renew it, R-E-N-E-W, and then hit enter. Basically what this will do is it'll give you a, a, a fresh start and, you know, check and see, you know, and not all the servers that you sign into are actually going to give you the 3659. Basically it works like this. Um, if you were to run a trace from where you actually live to the server you're actually connect connecting to, it goes through all these different hubs. And what we did was we ran a trace on my friend and he was connecting to the server, but when it was coming back to him, it was you know everything was timed out so we tried this and he was able to connect um, I hope it works for everybody it definitely worked for him I hope it works for you my name is Tim as always please subscribe uh, if you're interested leave a comment if this doesn't work you know and uh, leave us your message and we'll definitely try to help you figure something else out for sure all right my name is Tim you guys have a great day and a better tomorrow thank you